would help if we turned the camera on, maybe. Oh, we hit it, and now we're in a loop. It would help if we turned the camera on, maybe. Oh, we hit it, and now we're in a loop. Oh guys, I am so sorry. We haven't got all the kinks worked out yet. Oh guys, I'm so we, sorry. We are working on that. Ugh, this is embarrassing. <laughs> this is horribly, horribly embarrassing. No, it's not. This is okay. We're we're getting it we're getting the kinks worked out because what are we doing today, Shelby? I don't know. Where are we broadcasting to? All over the place. All over the place. We're not just in the building, people. This is out into the community. And way to start it on a Monday morning, having apparently there was no audio during the pledge. I apologize for that. Forgot to turn the camera on. What else was it, Shelby? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But, but with that being said, we are going to go ahead and get started. Shelby, what's for lunch today? In the main line, there's hamburgers on a bun, sweet potato puffs, and on choice, it's pizza. What? Smart pepperoni on the choice line. I don't. What is pizza smart pepperoni? I don't know. I literally that is how it is written on the menu. I'm not sure what that is. It could be a slab of pepperoni. More than likely not. It could Probably be a maybe a bagel know. or something with pepperoni, or is it like the pizza bread? I don't know. I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> what else is going on? What happened this weekend? Anything? I don't. Know. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah. You know, the news, the stuff yeah. that we're supposed to be reading. Yeah. Is it cross country? Cross country. That's what XC stands for. Cross country. Let me say 12, please. The, the Lincoln County High School cross country yeah, team so placed did. third place uh, this past Saturday at the Ironton Last Chance Rumble. You want to read the individual places, please? Um, there's Sam, Sam Bays, Blake mm -hmm. Smith, Aaron Smith. Caleb Aggins and D Dustin Gerperson. And girls was Lydia Robert. Roberts. Lydia Roberts, she placed ninth overall. Way to go, Lydia. Pretty good. Yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, just a reminder that on Wednesdays in October, what are we wearing? Pink. Pink. And they're going to collect those points in? I don't know. AA. Your AA teachers will collect those <laughs> points and that. send those to Miss Hensley. It was last week. We did that. We just did this like less than a week ago. I don't watch this. You, d <laughs> you don't watch the news. Sometimes I do. Oh, Shelby, you're killing me. You're killing me. Uh, there's new scholarship information available in the counselor's office. Miss Mullen sent me a long email with a bunch of different names. What I'm going to try and do is put them on the school channel so they'll re they'll play in a loop instead of all that stuff that was playing this last weekend. We just we started broadcasting on Friday. Uh, to the whole community uh, didn't have a whole lot so I just put a lot of the content up from last year to let it loop through off my off my uh, computer in here which I think it went really well did you watch any of it no Shelby you're killing me you're killing me Shelby well you didn't tell me it was on okay well now everybody should know that we are on Armstrong channel 39 you guys are watching it on 39 in your classrooms and you can watch it in channel 39 in the community too. So if you're at your house, I, I saw that uh, Dave, you know Dave, right? Yeah. Big Dave, love Dave. David posted, he was watching a bunch of the videos this weekend on his Facebook page. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, candidates for uh, homecoming attendance, we've got those for the junior class, sophomore class. However, I will tell you the freshman, she won by default which was Jordan Miller because she was the only one who applied. So way to win, Jordan. Woo! You want to get the other ones? Miss Sophomore Candidates, Savannah Aggins, Sarah Bug Barrett, Francis Hall, Lindsay Pritchard, and Kayla Sowards. And for our junior candidates? You can read that. Rose Polly, Natalie Saul, Heather Dunlap, Haley Lambert, and Ashton Graham. So I think campaigning starts this week. Uh, homecoming is when? The 19th. The 19th. So we got we got a few days away. So this Friday we play away. Football team plays away. Where? Do you know where? Oh, mm -hmm. uh, Greenbrier County. Got to go to Greenbrier. It's a long bus, long bus drive to Greenbrier County. How long is it? Several hours. Oh, okay. I think it'll be the longest bus trip uh, yet. But it'll be a good one. Um, so we play uh, away there on uh, Friday. This Saturday, this week, they, if you didn't notice last week, the JRTC program, they've been prepping the obstacle course. They've got a big event here. Are you a part of that? No. You're not? Oh. 
I'm, in, I'm with the FFA now. <laughs> oh, you're with the FFA. Okay. Well, the FFA has a big event this weekend, too. You want to tell us about it? Um, we're having auction. You're having the auction. So what is that? What do they do? Do you know? Have you ever participated in an auction before? No. Well, last year when I saw the pictures, a lot of people would bring stuff in from the community.